Hey guys, I'm back again with another video. This time we are doing all 12 kids of my OC. Guys, yeah, we'll be going in order from oldest to youngest. And they all be in the playlist alongside with with the fathers, with the fathers and mothers. Just pick profiles as well. So further ado, here we go with the firstborn offspring of his entire bloodline and and considered as the main considered as the king of of the Atlantic Kaiju what not what the then that's king of the great old ones. Guys, ladies and gentlemen, I introduce y'all to Space <sighs> Space Godzilla Ultima. Space Godzilla Ultima stands at a height around 324 meters. Well, not 24. It goes 29, I think. Oh, no. It, yeah, it was 29. His age, he's actually, he is actually 24 years old. Weight unknown, length currently unknown. Personality is more like similar to his father's than his mother's. Well, he stares serious his mother's little rape, little freaking anger, anger, but he stares his father's honor. Appearance more or less like a gigantic God's version of God's little Ultima, but he has similar features with Trespasser from Pacific Grim. If you guys do not know what I'm talking about, he has yellow like markings on him, along with some like the spikes on Trespasser. The teeth like tr tr Trespasser's like teeth and for hot and floor yellow glowing eyes. And he also has Godzilla 1962 dorsal spines. Now he does not have. Now he does not have the ability similar to his father. At least not yet. But. But he does has ability similar. He does have his father's. Well, he does still has ability similar to Ultima. The only one he's able, the only one he currently has right now is able to create a the the Red Mist. Create a bunch of. Create a bunch of blood tentacles that comes out of him, similar to his father, and able to make weapons out of his own blood. A trait kind of similar to his father as well. It, the bloodline of this Titan, he is 50% outer Gojira, 50% great. Great old Gojira and fifty percent Leviathan. So yeah. So yeah, I guess you could say he's mainly a high. So yeah, he's a hybrid between both a Leviathan. A great old Gojira and an elder Gojira. <sighs> for for those of you guys who knows, but Space Godzilla Final Wars is a great old Gojira, outer Gojira hybrid. Now, family tree. He has 
his grandfather's nemesis prime himself, the Galactic Gojira, or the first Galactic Gojira. That's his great great that's his great grandfather. Yeah, his grandfather is in space Dagon and the outer Gojira and his grandmother Sonia a great old Gojira father is Space Guys of Final Wars a hybrid between the two and his mother being Empress Yor aka the Empress Leviathan who is also a Leviathan as well he, I'm not going to do all his civil I'm not going to do all his like brothers and sisters I'm not going to say all five of his freaking well, almost all his brothers and sisters as well. So no, no, no. We'll do them for another day, another time. He does have a mate who I'm still currently working on the name of. But she's more like a female uh she's basically like a female Muto. No, a female re- a female space rodeo. And her name is Fem Uh Freak, I may have forgotten her name. Eh, who cares? Now his Atomic Breath is similar is not some or it's not very similar to Ultima's But the color is red with it, with your like rings surrounding it. Sorry, guys. I saw I heard something. Now, now his ranking is a warrior, but he wants to live his life. Uh, no, his ranking as a warrior. But he refused to be the next king of the space kite of the great old ones. But yet the king of the gal of the entire space kaiju race. From its subspecies to its sister to its Yeah, to its subspecies to every space kaiju from in the universe. He would rather give that title to one of his siblings. Like, like his younger brother, like his younger brother, or well, one of his younger brothers. But that's gonna be it, guys. Like on Scrammer, long live the king. Oh yeah, you guys wanna know what ranking he's in? Oh yeah, his title. Eight. It's basically unknown for now.